If you work in Minnesota, you will have new rights in the new year. Alex Jokic breaks down the changes in state law. Come January 1st, there are some pretty big changes for Minnesotans with everything from interview questions to sick days. Whether you work in a coffee shop or a big downtown office building, Minnesotans will now be guaranteed sick and safe time. It's a public health imperative that we um, support people in staying home and getting better. Senator Sandy Pappas has been pushing for this change for nearly a decade. About a million Minnesotans, more than a third of the workforce, didn't have this benefit before. Now, workers will earn at least one hour of paid sick time for every 30 hours on the clock, up to 48 hours a year. It can be used for anything from being sick yourself to caring for a sick family member, an absence because of domestic abuse, or if your child's school is closed because of weather. I hope that we'll hear many more stories about how um, businesses have been able to attract and retain workers because they're offering the benefits that workers expect. Same goes for several other new workplace laws, including one about money. When interviewing for a new job, employers will no longer be able to ask you about your past pay. Advocates say this will break a vicious cycle and help close the pay gap for women and people of color. And at Minnesota's meatpacking plants and oil refineries, there will be new safety standards in 2024, including more training for those who do a lot of heavy lifting. We've talked to business owners who say these changes, like paid sick days, do increase some of their costs, but... The reward, the investment pays off in staff who stay, who, who feel secure. If you'd like to take a closer look at these new laws and how they apply to you, we've posted all the details at KSTP.com. In the newsroom, Alex Jokic, 5 Eyewitness News.